What up? I'm not going to play hardcore anymore. I'm done. That was it. So basically what happened was that um, I started dreading playing. Uh, it was just like, it, it felt like a chore to play. It was like, oh, how am I going to play this? If I'm going to die, what's going to happen? How do I craft my gear? Is this good? It's like, oh, I was like, I was just so dreading playing. And then I just like, I skipped playing for a couple of days. I postponed that. And I was like, and I started playing one day. I opened the map and there was a, like, um, 18% increased monster damage, vulnerability. I was like, oh, fuck this. Just like put it in the map. I went in and then just found a um, syndicate thingy and this guy jumped me and killed me and I was like and that was the first map like it was like yesterday two days ago first map in I died and I was just like fuck what happened I killed Hillock on the new character and I was like nope I'm not playing this this is just too awful and like and the reason, I think the reason why I didn't enjoy playing hardcore in the end, like, it seemed like an like exciting idea. And I did enjoy the Dell of hardcore event because it was like a short event. But this event, like playing hardcore overall, it just didn't feel right because um, I didn't feel really excited to play. But I felt anxious, like, you know, because like, I think that, like uh, feeling excited, excitement comes from being anxious about something or like a little bit scared. But then you want to like overcome it and just try it out. I was just anxious, just like ah, oh, I didn't feel like say, wow, I can beat a boss or something like that. And probably it was also because a couple of reasons where I didn't know, I wasn't that experienced. I st I've started playing only since Delirium, really. So I was like, oh, how do I craft my weapons? Is this good? Or how, what, what do I do? I've just got these uniques. How would I do this? It's like, everything is new and it was like very, very awkward. So I don't think I'm gonna be playing anymore hardcore. Maybe I'll return to that. But uh, I just didn't enjoy it, man. I feel, I feel like the hardcore experience is good for players that uh, the three months are way too short and they just like finish very quickly, quickly in the league. And they have nothing to do. Like, I want to play, but there's nothing really for me to do. Oh, well. So I think this is good for these kind of players. And I did feel a little bit like that at the end of the last league. But uh, I haven't tried solo cell phone yet. And I think there's a lot of stuff I have to learn or have to do. So I think I have uh, still a lot to play and what to, what to learn uh, before I have to go hardcore. But I think it's just a good option for people who have to play a lot. And they... Uh, it's good for them to start over because uh, cause maybe they get bored of the character or um, they need a good reason to actually start over because like they're done okay how my perfect character is done and I just have like 100x on my solo self on what I do now like, I'm done like what do I do in this league so I think in that case hardcore help can help spice things up and okay I have to try this new build out actually oh I don't want to play this again or just, it just resets everything and then that sense of things good but for me I feel like the time, um, I, I, it's still not enough. I, I felt one of the reasons, biggest reasons I felt anxious is because I felt I would lose so much time and it just hurt. It's like, ooh, I will lose so much of the uh, progress because I don't have that much time to play like every day, all day, every day, right? So the time I spent playing um, Path of Exile, I really appreciate it and it's an awesome time. But I don't have abundance of it, and I, have the, I don't have a lot, so it's. Uh, I, I probably felt more anxious than I should because it's my, my time playing is just a little bit more valuable than I feel like. I feel it's more valuable because if I lose it, oh, I have to start over, and it's like a really, really big pain in the ass because um, I, I do take still like I took like eight, nine hours to level up my new character, and that's like a one day on the weekend, and like during the week I haven't have a lot time to play so this hardcore death for me is uh, much more punishing for people who play uh, maybe a lot more I do I feel like that at least but you know I'm gonna still keep on playing solo cell fun I think that's cool fun I'm um, looking forward to that and um, I would probably that's that's gonna be one step closer to maybe going back to hardcore someday that's that's not out of question in a sense that maybe uh, I, I do need to learn a little bit more about the game, how to play solo cell phone, because I, I'm just 
I uh, have a bunch of alterations. I'm not how, how do I do these alterations? So I was like, what, what do I do all this stuff I have right now? Because I have to use all my resources instead of I just sell them to someone else and I just buy what I need. And that's have to manage everything myself. And the progress progression as well. How do I progress? What do I prior, prioritize and progressing? I haven't tried a lot of builds. The last two leagues I played kind of the same build. Um, that's also one of my struggles. I, like, oh, how do I? I got to like Aziri's mirror prophecy. Like, what do I? What do I do with that? Like, who? What kind of character do I build around this? Or uh, occultists? Like, with the shafts, right? The best. I was like, w what do I do with this? Like, oh, what kind of character? I was like, there's so much I don't know about this game. So I think it's good, good start for me to go back one step back and just learn about the game a bit more. I was, I, I was, I was cocky, I guess, and overconfident on my my skill of, oh yeah, I'm gonna handle this hardcore, you know, figure it out. I haven't died a lot when I was playing my, uh, the trade league, and obviously in trade league there was, I could get stuff much easier, and that's why I didn't die. And I was just like specific character that was very strong, but I now I also start I guess start to see how strong the character was <laughs> survivability wise. Uh, awesome! Um, so looking forward to I will tra transfer all of my character stuff to solo cell phone now and start my solo cell phone adventure visual hardcore. Look very, and I'm, I am excited about that. So that makes me happy. Yes, I can go back and play solo cell phone now. That's. That's pretty cool, and uh, so let's do it. Uh, play solo cell phone for now, see how that feels. So thank you for watching, bye bye, and subscribe if you think this is good content. Yes.